Or, ooh, updates. Will Smith has posted on Instagram and publicly apologized to Christopher Rock. That's right, folks. Uh, here's the one-minute ad break first, and then I'm going to get into that. Let's take a look at what's going on here. Will Smith says, Violence in all of its forms is poisonous and destructive. My behavior at last night's Academy Awards was unacceptable and inexcusable. Jokes at my expense are part of the job, but a joke about Jada's medical condition was too much for me to bear, and I reacted emotionally. I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong. I'm embarrassed. My actions were not indicative of the man I want to be. There's no place for violence in a world of love and kindness. He also says, um, I would like to apologize to the Academy, the producers of the show. Why? See, the thing is, like, why do you apologize to the Academy? Because the Academy loved this shit. You know what I mean? Apologizing to Chris is the right thing to do and it's totally appropriate. Apologizing to the Academy is like, the Academy deserved it. You know what I mean? Like, fuck the Academy, one. And two, this only makes it, like, this only makes it more interesting and entertaining. Like, he literally added seasoning to the fucking otherwise, like, incredibly bullshit uh, and, and boring fucking, you know. And the producers of the show, all the attendees, and everyone watching around the world, I would like to apologize to the Williams family and my King Richard family. I deeply regret that my behavior has stained. Because otherwise, what has otherwise been a gorgeous journey for all of us. I'm a work in progress. Sincerely, Will. <laughs> I'm a work in progress, brother. You're like 50, dude. What do you mean you're a work in progress? It's done. The work is over at this point. Apologizing to the Academy strikes me as something you would do if you were invited to someone's house and then beat up one of their guests. Hassan saying people deserve things again. Yeah, hit the deck. Hassan has bought aim. What? Oh, no. I thirsted oh, my God. I fucking... Knocked another Georgie, one. Georgie, where are you? Nice. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Somebody's pulling his weight right now? This is it? Yeah, I'm reviving you. Don't move. Hassan, everyone's excited. Dude, Hassan has bot aim. After okay, to be fair, I didn't know that that gun had a lot of recoil, okay? Like, I oh my god, I fucking... I literally unloaded on him, and it hit not even a single one hit. They all just went above his head. For sure, his publicist wrote that. He doesn't give a shit. I think you guys are crazy. Of course he gives a shit. What do you mean, dude? He, like, behaved... He behaved in a way that was, like, ridiculous. You, you guys are incredible if you think that, like, he doesn't think that that was ridiculous. Of course he does. Man, you are so good. You're cheating. Thank you. That's what I thought, too. So White's trying to take his award while Weinstein has 500? Yeah. Oh, by the way. Let me tell you something about white folk, okay? They will take his fucking award away. While, while uh, uh, what do you call it? While fucking Weinstein has like 500. So, if you think that that won't happen, let me tell you, it will, okay? They 100%. And, and everyone will celebrate it too. They'll be like, wow, what an incredible decision. Like, everyone in media will be like, it had to be done. It had to be done. You know, he was, he was acting out of place. As they should. Shut the fuck up, Fakatis. Um, they won't. They'll suspend him from the Oscars. Today is the 29th of March. Woefully, I believed in a son. All my family savings have been lost. My children will now starve for my sins. I expect God himself will strike me with such righteous fury that my soul will be obliterated into oblivion. Never again will I believe. <laughs> oh, la, 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 la. Dude, I, I love... No fucking way. Twitch says you're playing Fortnite. I have been. Um, I have been. We're just waiting. We're waiting. Chris Rock's apology? Wait, why would he apologize? As a comedian, it can be difficult to understand which lines are crossed and which ones aren't. Last night, I crossed the line I shouldn't have and paid an enormous price of my reputation as a renowned comedian. Wait, what? Really? This is a joke? He apologized? 
Uh, comedy is never about poking fun at or making light of people with major ordeals uh, happening in their lives. I mean, that is kind of what comedy is about. Um, comedy is about using real life circumstances to create laughter and bring light to an otherwise dark world. With that said, I sincerely apologize to my friends Jada Pickett Smith, Will Smith, and the rest of the Smith family for the disrespect and disregard I displayed, which was unfortunate, bro unfortunately broadcast for the world to see. I hope that with time, forgiveness can come from the situation. We can all be better, more considered people in the end. Chris Rock. What Chris Rock did was one level under making fun of a cancer patient to their face. It's not funny. I think like making a fucking bad joke that's like out of pocket which this was is uh you know making a bad joke that's out of pocket which this was is one thing but like fucking I don't think he should have I mean I don't think he needed to apologize it's nice of him to apologize though regardless cuz you know he's a good dude that's like a good thing to do I guess by the way, uh, what the fuck? Like, saying that... I mean, it's not as bad as, like... It's not as funny as, like, male pattern baldness, but... Uh, you're, you're ridiculous for saying it's, like, literally one step below cancer. It's not one step below cancer. It's, like, multiple, multiple, multiple steps below cancer. That's insane. Hey, if you like this video, please subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. <laughs>